All right, what is going on, everyone? Welcome back. We are back again with yet yeah, again another unboxing. I'm bring you a little closer here. Um, Corbanth, a, a company that pretty much everyone in the lightsaber community knows. We all love them. They make some like really good sabers. I ordered from them on May 4th when the Anakin Skinny Flex. Is it called the Skinny Flex or Skim, uh, Slim Flex? I think it's called the Skinny Flex. But when the Skinny Flex came in. Now, when I first got the box, it, it did seem a little a smaller than the other ones, than the other sabers that I got. But I think they're, I think they're doing something where the blade isn't in the saber. Instead, like the saber's here and then the blade like lines up next to it and goes up as opposed to it just, you know, being in it and shooting straight up. So let's get into it. Um, you guys always criticize the way I handle scissors, so I am going to use a charging port. I don't know what this is, man, okay? But, alright, that's not really working too well. I'm just going to use my manly hands and just peel it open. Oh, wait. There we go. There we go. And then, is there another thing of tape? There it has to be, right? Oh, there's, <laughs> there's a lot of tape up here. All right, I'm just gonna try and, you guys see this? I'm just gonna go all in. Well, <laughs> I never thought tape would be this hard to take off, but here we are. All right, you see, you guys are probably criticizing me for the way I'm opening the box, because that happens every video, but at least I'm not using scissors this time, so you can't complain. Okay, I don't know what kind of tape this is, but oh my gosh. All righty. Got some bubble wrap. Always a classic. Oh, and we got peanuts, too. Packing peanuts. Obviously, it's not real peanuts. Or are they? I don't know. Alright. Oh, man. Guys, look at the way my hand is in right now, bro. I'm gonna get this thing cut off. Oh, baby. Okay, I'm just gonna, like, try and get all the packing peanuts out. There we go. I'm not trying to make a huge mess, but oh my goodness, these packing peanuts are about to make my life 10 times more miserable. Come on. All right, you know, I'm just gonna... All right. So the hilt itself is from 89 Sabres, um, but it's it was shipped to me by Corbanth because they do the installation of like the actual profi board. Not sure what this is. It might be the charging port. Not the charging port, the charger. Man, these packing peanuts. I can just pack in peanuts for days. 100,000 likes, and I will dump the peanuts. That's a lot shorter than... Oh, no, it's not. Never mind. This is like... This seems like it's around like a 30-inch 30, 30 blade. Well, let me go grab another blade just for comparison. All right. So this is a 36 inch blade. And uh, like this is this is more like a it was like a 30 34 inch blade. So you can see that it's a lot thinner than the other ones because it's a skinny flex blade. And I'm so happy that they sent me a blade. I was a little worried that they weren't just cuz I've never dealt with the Corban before. I don't know how they work. But um they sent me a blade, as you can see. So, I know that there's more stuff in this box. Or maybe there's not, actually. Hold on a second, guys. Oh, my goodness. It's just pure packing peanuts. I don't think there's any, anything else in this box. Thank God I didn't open it from the other end, because that would have been an absolute disaster. of just packing peanut. Just, hold on. 
can't really get the depth of how many packing peanuts there are in here, but this is where the packing peanuts, like, like they start here, obviously at the bottom, they end here. Just all packing peanuts. All right. I'm gonna save the best for last, which is the hilt. Assuming this is the charger, yes. It's just like the, um, the, uh, Saber Trio charger, so either interchangeable, I'm assuming. And now, oh man, okay. So, before I open this, Anakin Skywalker is my favorite Star Wars character. Well, Darth Vader is, but Anakin is Darth Vader, so Anakin is my favorite Star Wars character. Um, I grew up watching the prequels, Revenge of the Sith. I've seen that. When I was younger, I had to have seen that movie at least, like, 25 times. And in my um, later years, like, when I started to, um, you know, I wasn't, like, a little kid anymore, um, I probably saw it at least, like, 12 to 15 more times. And surprisingly, it's not my favorite movie. I just watched that movie because I love Anakin. Um, I think he's a great character. Empire Strikes Back is my favorite Star Wars movie. And then Revenge of the Sith is next. But a close third is A New Hope. So, let's open it. Well, I guess we're going to be here for a little while. Oh. Hold on. Oh. No. So... It isn't fully assembled. You still have to put the little the grips on it. And it comes with a blade plug. You got some Allen wrenches. And I'm, I think that I'm assuming this is the pommel. Okay, I'm trying to find out how I'm gonna get this out so I can actually show you guys. I actually debated wearing gloves for this because of how shiny the saber is. Look at that. Look at how beautiful that is. I'm already getting smudges on it. And I'm not kidding. Oh my gosh. And and the switch is um The, the switch is, uh, oh my gosh, this is actually pretty heavy. The switch is, um, canon accurate, unlike the Force Effects ones, where you press this. Oh, well, there's also a switch right here. Um, this might be the power on switch, but my goodness. The reason why I'm not wearing gloves for this when I debated on it is because it's gonna get scratches anyway. So, in the grip, the grip feels so nice. I just, oh, I, I just need to get this up in 4K. Cotton 4K Anakin lightsaber. You can see down there. Man, oh man. And um, they, they told me to charge the saber before using it. So I'm going to do that now. I don't know how exactly to get into this saber. So actually, you know what? Let's put on like the, the grips first. Let's do that, and then I'll charge it. So, oh man. These grips, you have to, to put, you, you have to stick them on. Um, I don't know how I feel about that, because there is a little hole in this where you have to put like a um, a Covertech clip in, and if I accidentally calculate it wrong and, and put Corbett, why did you do this to me? <laughs> you put way too much pressure on me. Um. Oh man. Um. Okay, I'm gonna look up how to how to like how to put it on, and then um I'll get back and I'm going to charge it before. It said, I'm pretty sure it said to charge it for around an hour. So I'm going to go put this thing on here. Put, like, the, the grips on the saber. Um, 
and then charge it while it's charging. I watch some Attack on Titan, um, and then I will come back. To you guys, it'll only feel like a hit, like less than a second, but it's going to be around an hour and maybe a half. Depends on um, how long it takes for me to put these grips on. And uh, yeah, so I will see you guys then. And here we go. All right, everyone. So I'm back. And um, I got the grips on, thankfully. But um, I'm not sure how straight they are. They seem pretty straight and they seem... They they look they look pretty good. So um, thankfully I have pretty good hand and eye coordination. But for someone who doesn't, this is going to be a, pr a pretty big challenge for you. They do they do give you two extras, and I did actually go through the two extras, having to do this because one of them was bigger than all the other ones, so it was really uneven. So I had to take it off and use a different one. Um, but uh, overall, it was a fine process. So I already pulled the kill key, so um, I could unscrew this. You know. What? I'll um, should I? Yeah, alright. I'll, I'll pull the kill key again, just so that you guys can hear the boot sound. I also got the Covertech wheel in there. It, the Covertech wheel, wheel really helped me, um, guide the, uh, the grips. If I didn't have that Covertech wheel, man, that would be bad. Alright, so the, the, uh, the kill key is in, and we pull it. What have I done? Get the what have I done sound from after, uh, Anakin helps kill Mace Windu in Revenge of the Sith, or kill mace windu really hope we get a darth vader tv show with mace windu as the villain that would be pretty cool or as the villain at antagonist all right that looks good now let's put the blade in and i found out how to screw in the blade is that in i think it's in um so this little thing above this is a little um, screw here, and you have to screw that in. So let me just get an Allen wrench, screw it in. There it is. And let's turn it on. Oh. Well, okay, I don't know why I was so delayed, but... <laughs> that scared me so much. It was so delayed. I don't know why. You killed Mace Windu, Anakin. How do I turn it off? No! No, that's copyright! That's copyright! Okay. Well, I almost just got strike there, but, um... That was pretty cool. Um, I don't know what this is doing. That might be the battery power. But um, this is a pretty pretty cool saber. Wait. Okay. I guess this isn't a... Uh what? What was that? How do I... What have I done? Alright, I guess we're back to this now. Alright. Um, still learning how to use this, but it's pretty freaking... It's, it's pretty cool. Look at that. Okay, thumbnail shot right here. Or we could do this. I don't know. One of them. Could do that, actually. I think that would be better. Gotta... <laughs> no, I might not do that. Um, but it's pretty freaking cool. I'm gonna turn off my LEDs. Go get the switch. There we go. Now you can really see how cool this is. I'm just... Hmm. Alright. So 
So thankfully, Corbin released a uh, a guide on how to use this without um I mean with the with the one switch because this only has one switch. Still, to yet to find out what this is for. But um overall, I love this saber. It actually um some funny is. The sound quality, I've noticed, the sound quality on other Neo Sabres that I've gotten are, they aren't much worse. They're not bad, but they're worse than the Sabre Trio. The Sabre Trio speaker is very, 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 very good. And it really shows in comparison how much better it is than, um, uh, like all the other speakers that other Sabres supply. I'm in no way saying the Corbanth audio is bad. It's very, very good. Um, but the Saber Trio one is just uh, perfect. <sighs> Man, we can do the, we, can, we can now do the uh, the Finn ignition from Force Awakens. Oh no! Oh, okay, that worked. I, I don't know what I did, but no, turn it off. There we go. Can I do the Finn ignition? Come get it. Oh man, that is that is this is so great, man. It's like I didn't even touch anything, but all right. Um, my first profi saber, actually it's not, but my first like very high quality profi saber, and I have to say it is a hundred percent worth it, guys. This is a beautiful saber. The hill is fantastic. Everything about the saber I love already. Uh, it, the the one switch is gonna have to. Um, use some like, getting used to um but it should be fine it does have a second switch though which is the weird part maybe if i no the second switch i don't think it does anything maybe you can program it to do something um this switch right here but um it doesn't do anything so this is the main switch i actually like this being the main switch because that's in star wars canon where the switch is and most uh, saber companies have the switch right here, especially Hasbro, and it's a it's a huge throw off. I'm assuming this slider right here, like in canon, is to adjust the saber height, because we learned with um, Kanan saber in Rebels that um, lightsabers can adjust height on the fly, um, which is kind of an OP ability if you really think about it, because um, you could be like in a lock with someone, and then you could just increase the height and kill them, <laughs> like. If you, like, try and jab someone and you just miss, just increase the height, kill them instantly. Um, but that's going to be it for the video, guys. Um, I'm going to make a video on all the fonts that are on here. I don't know um, which ones are on here. Um, but I will make a video on it. And um, I'm going to be displaying it on this. And uh, I just really can't wait to use this more. Um, I love it already. Uh, Anakin, my favorite Star Wars character. Um, this, this is pretty cool. This, this is pretty cool. Um, just, like, ha being able to hold it in my hand, it's, it's pretty great. It's pretty great. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, you know, if you want to subscribe, go ahead. You don't have to if you don't want to. Uh, and, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much. And, um... Time to go swing this around a little bit. <laughs> See you guys later.